I'm Sean Lee, and today we're going to take this uh, DeWalt planer uh, with its uh, manual gauge here, which is not very accurate, and we're going to replace it with the eye gauging uh, Easy Planer DRO. And this is a digital readout, be much more accurate. So uh, we'll show you how to install that now. Stay tuned. All right, so here's what the uh, digital kit comes with. It comes with the, the DRO, of course, and the two attachment screws. Um, and this is the uh, attachment piece for the top to keep it uh, level when I'm not moving. Uh, that's the uh, bolt that goes with it. And you're going to need to drill one hole, so it comes with the uh, drill bit to do that. All right, so let's get started. All right, so the first thing we want to do is uh, we're going to remove this guy here. So we'll want to unscrew both of those. Okay, so we'll go ahead and remove these screws. And set this aside. We don't need this anymore. All right, so let's uh, fit this. We'll take our screw and place it in here. So, now I'm not going to put the second screw on at the moment uh, because we're going to have to actually drill a hole. If you see this hole up here, we're going to have to drill a hole to put the uh, to put this bracket on. Okay, and the bracket needs to go with the thick end out so that way it's uh, even. Yeah. Don't <laughs> don't do it like that. All right, um, so the this part is threaded, so it'll go through the block, uh, through the machine, and thread into the back. So we can go ahead and, uh, and do that now. Okay, and you can adjust this up or down, it's just a, a scale. So we, uh, up there a little too high, we'll hit the top here. So we can just move it down a little bit and uh, set that like that. All right. Okay, let's move that out of the way for the moment. Okay, and then we want to... See if we can mark this here. All right, so I've made a mark. Okay. Now we'll take our handy drill. And with the drill bit uh, that's actually provided, Center there. All right. Cool. Okay. So place that on here. Screw through. Block. So I want to tighten it up. All right, I've got it tight for now. <laughs> Get these little bits of plastic we drilled off here. All right, and then we're going to attach the uh, the second screw. And tighten up the first one. Okay, and we. All right, so now we've got this screw tightened up. Let's tighten up the Allen Allen screw here. So, there we go, and that's a, a 3 16 uh, Allen wrench. I'm sorry, it's a 5 30 seconds Allen wrench. Okay, so now that's all tight and secure. Okay, now that we've got everything secure, we want to actually calibrate this. All right. So, how do we do that? Well, we're going to put a, a 2 inch block in here, and then we're going to crank this guy down, uh, set it to 2 inch, and then we'll actually uh, arrange this so that it, it also says 2 inch. All right, so let's do that next. Okay, all right, so now I've got my uh, handy dandy uh, eye gauging one, two, three block. All right, so I'm going to use the uh, the two inch sign. Uh, let's put that in there, like so. All right, it's nice and flat. There. And then uh, we're going to crank this, crank it down. Okay, until it stops. So now we're set at two inches height. So let's uh, actually calibrate this. 
All right, so first thing we want to do is we're going to turn it on. Okay, so now it says 1.785, whatever. So that obviously that's not right. So we want to hold this down okay. until you see the calibration button blink and then hold it down a long period again. And now you'll see the number blink. So we want to press the short button twice. So now we're at two inches. Okay, and then just hold it down as it goes through all the zeros. Okay, and then we'll get back, you'll see the cal blinking again. Just tap once. Oh, right again, tap once. Okay, so now we're set at exactly two inches and you're calibrated. All right, so let's, uh, let's try this out. Let's pull this out of the microphone. Right there. Okay, you can see that it's going up. Great. Let's put the two inch block back in there again. I left the good mic at home. There we are. Okay, so now that we've calibrated this, there's three different modes. You can have uh, fractional like this. So you got the, you know, the two and the eight there as we crank it. You can see that's uh, fractional. Okay. Decimal inch, fraction inch, and you have millimeter. Okay. Okay. Great. Okay. Well, thank you for watching, and that's. How easy it is to install the uh, planar DRO, the easy planar DRO, and how easy to install and calibrate. You can do it in about 10 minutes. So, all right, thanks for watching. Have a great day.